Hi, this is Let's Talk Tara. Today we're going to be talking about breaking cycles. Stop focusing on the fruit and focus on the root. So often in life, we want to break cycles of unwanted circumstances, unwanted emotions, unwanted behaviors. But we keep seemingly keep going repeating the same cycles over and over and over again. There's only one way you can break cycles and that's to recognize those cycles. We want change. We always seem to look at the effect instead of the effect. We look at the behavior or the symptoms of the problem, but we never take the time to look at the root of the problem. So today I want to just share a little bit with you about breaking those cycles. Stop looking at the fruit and look at the root. Stop looking at the fruit. The fruit is the symptoms. You know when you see a tree, you only know what type of tree it is because of the fruit. It's always a tree, but you can't recognize what that tree is the only way you recognize what the tree is, is when you look at the fruit. We know it's a tree, but we never, we may not want those fruit. We may be looking for an orange tree, but every time we turn around, there's an apple tree. How do you look at and change a cycle if you keep looking at the fruit and you never change or look at the root? I love the parable of Jesus and the fig tree. And it says that he saw this fig tree. He was walking by. He was hungry. And if you know anything about a fig tree, the fig tree says this. If you see the leaves on a fig tree, there should be fruit there. Well, he saw the leaves on the fig tree, so he was assuming that there was fruit there. Well, when he got there hungry, looking for some fruit, he turned the leaf around and there was no fruit there. No fruit there. He didn't get mad at the leaf. He didn't even get mad at the fruit which is the symptom. What he did was he spoke to the root of the problem because it wasn't the fruit that was the problem. It wasn't even the leaf. It was the root that contaminated what should have been there. So when we're trying to break cycles in our life, we have to stop looking at the cause effect, those behaviors, those unwanted emotions, but go and look and search the root of the problem so that we can change the cycle we can change the cycle. For 16 years, I was married. I was unhappy, complaining all the time about the root, about the fruit of the problem, sorry, about the fruit of the problem. The fruit of the problem was he wasn't spending enough time with me. I didn't think he loved me. He wasn't doing enough with the kids. He wasn't a good provider. I was looking at the fruit of the problem until I went on my journey and said, hey, you know what? I'm going to stop looking at the fruit and I'm going to look and reevaluate and see the root of the problem. And the root of the problem was unmet expectations. I got so upset and was going through the same cycle, having these same conversations only because I had unmet expectations that were never met. I kept focusing on the fruit of the problem and I never focused on the root of the problem. Are you ready to, to, to break those cycles in your life? It's time for you to start looking at the fruit. Stop looking at the fruit and start looking at the root of the problem. Look at the root of the problem because you can only destroy a tree from, the, from its root. You can cut the tree down, you can cut the branches down, you can shake the fruit, but guess what? After a while, it's going to grow back up. It's going to continue to grow. So you have to address the root of the problem. You have to address the root of the problem. It's time for us to break the cycles in our life. Stop looking at the fruit and focus on the root of the problem.